right, I hope it works. Well, it's not yellow, that's for sure. Obvious one. Where does it go? Well, it's not yellow, that's for sure. All right. Well, it's not yellow, that's for sure. Well, it's not yellow, that's for sure. This one is blue. It's as red as red goes. Obvious one. Where does it go, though? Obvious one. Where does it go, though? This one is blue. Well, it's not yellow, that's for sure. It's as red as red goes. Well, it's not yellow, that's for sure. This one is blue. It's as red as red goes. Obvious one. Where does it go, though? Well, it's not yellow, that's for sure. This one is blue. It's as red as red goes. Obvious one. Where does it go, though? Obvious one. Where does it go, though? Alright. Where, where am I? Take it easy, buddy. You're among friends. What? <coughs> what was going on? It's a long story. You were kidnapped, murdered, and stripped of your internal parts. Although not too long, I guess. I, I was dead? Oh, holy motherboard! Hey, aren't you that guy who's dating Betty Davis? I mean... <laughs> you have some catching up to do, accountant. This bundle of joy here is Fixie Mender. She's the one who put you back together. Uh, I'm sorry. This is a lot to take in all at once. Can you remember anything about the night you were kidnapped? No. I, I after the union meeting, I got to my apartment, and, and the next thing I knew, I, I woke up here. Wait, wait, wait. Don't you record everything you hear? What if you were recording for a couple of minutes still, like, like, like after you died, you know? Kid, you're a genius. I, I guess that could work. Uh, d d let me check. Happy birthday, Tiger. Ready for your present. Oh, oh. What did you... <coughs> um, um, uh, that, that, that's not... That, that, that's something else. Um, uh, j j just a second. Oh, Robbie! It, it's, it's still not... Um, uh, 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 let me just... Um, uh, <coughs> Should I be here for this? Ah, there we go. Please be alright.
You too. What the hell is going on? You'll read about it in the papers tomorrow. We don't have time to explain it now. Who are they talking about, Ted? I don't know, kid. Although... What? Nothing. Let's get to the Jungle Jazz Bar. We have some fish to catch. What about this guy over here? I, I don't think I can walk j just yet. Huh. That's what she... Don't you dare! Right. You stay here, buddy. Fixie will take care of you. Won't you... F what the hell? We'll be back for him. I owe you one. Ted, you better fix this fast, goddammit. Oh, damn... Oh, damn it! Damn it! Bye, miss. I'm sorry. You're off the hook, sweet chicks. Just hurry up. So... Ah. Oh. oh. Yeah. A am I missing a finger? Who knew paper cities? It's fake. <laughs> good one, Harold. Yeah, good one, Harold. What the hell are you talking about, Bear? Don't you have some other actress? Okay, I've had enough. Shh. Lily's about this. Yeah! Let's take it for a nice steady walk. What do you say? Give me a couple of high notes, baby. Money. Mmm, beautiful. Me. It's Sam, the piano. And a good piano player. Lily's. Go figure. It says trap. I'm sorry, Lily. I hope she lands. Beaks right now, Snoop. Yeah. There we go. Careful. Oh! It's just how I imagined! It sure is a beaut. Mazel tov. Here's a quarter for your- Listen, Snoop. We're not really- No. You listen to me. Now. Why should we? I found Robbie, you stupid idiot. Whoa, whoa. Who? Robbie and Rob As if he'll tell you anything. Why wouldn't Bear? Remember what we talked about? Not Safe bet. Okay, Ted. You got our attention. Hey! You got my attention. Let's say you did find him. Presumably, he told you something. Right. Okay, smart guy. Very. The fr- Alright, but- Like where? Baron. Okay. Yeah. Okay, fine. After Barry bites his two. Hmm. Hmm. Hey, you came up with the damn system. Okay, fine. Sure, sure. What do I feed? Yeah. Okay, what's going? I told you, idiots. I got the key witness, and I got the paper trail proving. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Okay. I want to make a deal. Sure. 
Hey guys, did you see? Hey. Wait, what are we talking about? Where are you going? Come on, man. Well, tell I owe you, buddy. Locke. Yeah, no, it's me. But wait, wait. What do you mean it's done? It's not done. Skinner was just buying the stuff. Listen, just meet me at the old lighthouse. Tonight. Down by the bay. Locke. He hung up? He hung up. So? Like that's out of the norm. It's really not. What isn't? How everyone's tr- I. It's fine. Still, we basically solved it. I wasn't on my own. So what now? Let's go. Oh, good. I was hoping. Switch. I mean... What? I was talking to him. Oh, I, I'm just getting some rest. M my head is still... That's great, buddy. Good to hear it. Listen, we need your help. What's the plan here, Ted? Okay. As far as PCPD is concerned, the case is closed. Smiley is going down for a long time. Great. Case closed. Get out. Not quite, doll. Oh. Those two idiots are going to meet with whoever's hiring them tonight and your plan is to we're going to bring the heat but you just said that the police aren't going to help the police are but you are oh i don't know about this it, 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 it sounds dangerous don't worry you were already dead once today oh o okay then so we need to make some modifications to this guy first oh i get it we're gonna bluff that's right kid we'll need some bright lights up there Play some police noises and boom, we got ourselves a confession. Well, either that. That's. that's what I mean. Um. Alright, people, let's get to work. I got that. So this. It's the place, alright. No, I mean for the showdown. I like. Kind of a cliche, if you ask me. Dad? Yeah. For what it's worth? Ah, oh, shucks, kid. Shut up. I just wanted to let you know. That's all. Thanks, kid. I had a good time. I know, I know. That's the plan. It's just a shrubbery of might be a good hiding. Long way up. Short way down, kid. It's the sea. Use the sea. It's a first aid kit. No capacitors in this one, though. I'll take the bandages with me. You never know. It's filled with light bulbs, presumably. Maybe we can use one. It's full of light bulbs. Take one with you. Way ahead of you. Nice. The bulb fits. Okay. Hope this stays on. There. This should work. I still think welding was a better idea. What? No. I'm not turning him into prey. There, it's working. It's using power from his auxiliary battery. How are you feeling, Robbie? It, it feels okay, I, I guess. Great. We're all set. I have a bet. Don't worry, kid. This is definitely not the stupidest thing I've ever done. Just shut up, Ted. Fair enough. Let's go. Finally! Try not to get him killed again. He'll be fine. Won't you? Um, I really don't think... See. Okay. Let's head out. All right, count. I'm... I, I don't... 
Will you stop freaking him out? Right. I'm sorry. Listen, Robbie, it's going to be fine. The kid and I are going up top. And you stay here hidden. Uh, um... Exactly. When you hear the door slam up top, you start blasting that light and play some police... Can you do that? Yeah. <laughs> sure, I, I can do that. I knew you'd pull through. I mean, I, I was voted. Yeah, I know you are. You stay hidden until you hear the door slam. Okay, I'm ready. Okay, the boy's in blue. She'll be here soon. Just remember the de- I can't get you full immunity. You're- Okay, but maybe half immunity? Um... Shh, I hear someone. Good evening, ma'am. What's good about it? Ma'am, we were thinking, and... No, you weren't. Otherwise, you wouldn't tell that goddamn bear about the relays. I... I'm still talking, Fresh. Now, Skinner got arrested. But we thought you wanted him out of the picture! Not like this. The bulls will make him sing. You two need to take care of him. <clears throat> Speaking of the police... What's this? Lose the cloak, would you? You're not fooling anyone. Well, well. You two got this far? I'm somewhat impressed. Miss Warkovsky? I mean, kid. You're the only one still surprised by this? He doesn't know you well enough. I should have known something was up. I'm surrounded by incompetent idiots. And by us! And yet, the only one I hired because he is an incompetent idiot turned out to not be so incompetent after all. Good job, Bear. Oh, by the way, I cracked the case. It was you all along. Well, you're still not getting paid. Seeing you behind bars will do. That's funny, Snoop. In case you forgot how to count, you're outnumbered. But, are we really? I've had enough of this. Take care of him, will ya? Um, door slam. What's this? You brought the police? So, mind doing a recount? Go to hell, Snoop! What are you waiting for? Shoot him! I'm... I'm sorry, ma'am. What? What are you... Kill them! Now! Ma'am, we have... They sold you out, is what he's trying to say. It's over, Miss Wachowski. Harold, you spineless bastard! Ah! Ooh. I did. Told you this was a cliché location. These things always turn out this way. I'm sorry, Bear. I can't believe he's gone, Gus! Come on, let's go get ready. Yeah. Somehow, this all turned out for the best. I would rather see Lifty Warkovsky behind bars than dead. But I guess she didn't share my sentiment. The bodies were never recovered, however, and it's anyone's guess as to what happened to them. The official statement issued by the PCPD pinned Skinner as the sole mastermind behind the events. Despite my best efforts to expose the whole truth, Locke wasn't interested. A scumbag in jail is worth two scumbags in the wild, he said. On the bright side, with a little help from the fresh, all the missing robots were dug up and put back together. He got a good deal in the process. He never did see Harold again, though. At the press conference, Locke and his goons took the stage. We were pushed aside, but hey, as I told the kid already, I'm not doing this for credit. 
Some robots were saved. That's enough for me. In the light of all the recent events, I finally mustered up some courage to pick up the phone and give Betty a call. All I got was her voicemail. It will be a long time before I find the courage again. I like to think she's better off. Anyways, I guess, in the end, just like me, she kind of dodged a bullet too. Robbie's doing fine. He's back to his usual self. Whatever that is. Fixie Mender got a little press coverage as well. Her business got a boost, and I'm really glad for her. I'm glad for all of them. I've spent so much time brushing up against Paper City's underbelly that I forgot about the good people living here. People I like to call friends. I'm sad to see the kid go, but I understand. He's got his own thing going on. There's not much room left for an old relic such as myself. And that's, that's okay. I'm sure Amber is going to be just fine. The important thing is that Flint now understands that what happened wasn't really his fault. I'm just glad that by the end he got to feel a little more at ease. Sam caught us as we were leaving the conference. He took a picture of the real hero, as he puts it. I couldn't agree more. Who cares about recognition anyways? The kid was the real hero of the story. He did good. He saved them robots, and he saved me. He gave me something to do. Seriously, maybe we could do this again sometime. You know, you and me. Oh, and Amber. Like, the three of us. That, that sounds nice, kid. Let's do that. Yeah. Let's. <coughs> Would you close the window? Sure, buddy. <coughs> There's ash from the engine flying in. <coughs> Just a sec. Thank you. Oops, I hit the wrong button. Um, anyways. Yeah, so we know what happened after that because, um, basically he, he died of, uh, carbon monoxide poisoning because if you heard him at the ending, he said he said ash was coming in through the window so he closes the window not knowing that there was a fire downstairs and he can hear him coughing and stuff so that's a sign of uh something was wrong he didn't know it and yeah so basically he fell asleep waiting for his parents to come back from the hospital not knowing there was a fire downstairs and um then he fell asleep and died from the monoxide, carbon monoxide, and caused by the fire, and it's really sad. It's depressing. <laughs> this whole game series is depressing, especially with the first one, with the, uh, you had no idea what was going on with, with the Amber until the ending of revealing that she's just trying to figure out what to do with her life now that her brother's dead. <laughs> <laughs> kind of sad, honestly. Alright. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Bye.